This is Mick Foley. This is Harley Race. This is Shelton Benjamin. This is Mr. Wonderful Paul Lorndorf. This is the Monster Abyss. And this is Daniel Bryan. This is JBL, and you're watching the MWF. Be there live. Wrestling fans, Dan Marotti back at MWF Studios during a fall nor'easter as John Cena Sr. enjoys the sunshine of Universal Studios in Orlando, Florida, was happy to enjoy two days with Junior Ambassadors Brandon J. and Devon Brennan at Halloween Horror Nights. Exceptional experience, uh, but with so much work to be done for November the 13th, it was really hard to relax and focus on a little fun, but that's the nature of our industry. Two major additions to our anniversary extravaganza, an unfortunate subtraction, an event that was all over social media last week. A hacksaw Jim Duggan went in for emergency surgery. Um, you know, there was some fear at some time, uh, but luckily this isn't a situation like we had with Road Warrior Animal and Paul Lorndorf. Hacksaw Jim Duggan uh, had the surgery. He is home. He is recuperating. Uh, but the doctor said there is absolutely no way he can travel at this time. We've invited Jim to be part of our Legends reunion in April, and while he'd certainly like to, uh, while we spoke with Mrs. Duggan herself, she said they can't give us the official hacksaw thumbs up as of yet, but they do hope to be with us. If you're a religious or a spiritual person, send Hacksaw some positive vibes down in South Carolina. Get the old legend pumped up to be 100% and be with us in April. As a result, with limited time to go to the event, replacing Hacksaw on the VIP list will be none other than 2015 WWE Hall of Famer Bushwhacker Luke. The veteran from Down Under returns to Boston Wrestling MWF for the first time in over 10 years for a very rare appearance here in Massachusetts. Uh, Luke will also be with us in Tampa taping episodes of Wrestling Insiders this December. Luke is a great friend of Hacksaw's and will add a lot of fun to a night of superstars and legends of yesterday, today, and tomorrow. Speaking of superstars of today, very pleased to announce that All Elite Wrestling's Jora Joel will be debuting at our 20th anniversary. Part of Matt Hardy's faction, uh, he's yet another athlete looking to climb the ladder of success in the King of Sports, along with the fame he's gaining each week on AEW television and their media platforms. He's looking for a W here in his Boston Wrestling MWF debut. Also happy to announce the return of longtime MWF favorite, hard-hitting Bobby Ocean, who debuted with us in the summer of 2009. Ocean's still young enough that he hasn't even hit his peak yet, no pun intended, but as another exceptional athlete competing inside the squared circle as we go back to the 90s right here in Melrose. Fans, let me tell you, Saturday night, November the 13th, Memorial Hall tried to sabotage this great event itself, but we are going to create memories that'll last a lifetime with VIP guests including two-time WWE World Champion and Hall of Famer Bob Backlund, WWE Hall of Famer Bushwhacker Luke, former WWE Intercontinental and Tag Team Champion Marty Jannetty, the Doctor of Style Slick, the Berserker, Dunk the Clown, Duke the Dumpster Drossy, and Portuguese Man of War Aldo Montoya, also joined by two-time Impact Wrestling Champion, Die Hard Eddie Edwards, trained just down the street by Killer Kowalski, JTG of Crime Time, John Cena Sr., Oscar of Men on a Mission, and now AEW's Jara Joel. Just the VIP exclusive Q&A session and meet and greet is growing bigger by the day. After the autographs are signed and the photos are taken, every athlete on the roster is going to be looking to make a big time impression as we kick off the third decade of Boston Wrestling MWF in style and bring the heat to downtown Melrose, Mass, where you're going to be so close to the ring, you're going to feel like you're inside of it. Fans, the VIP packages for this event are flying, especially if you want the VIP Ultra or Platinum packages. All VIP packages and tickets are on sale now at bostonwrestling.com, along with individual autograph and posed photo tickets. This is an event 20 years in the making. We'll see you live at Memorial Hall in Melrose, Saturday night, November the 13th.